This piece is for anybody out there that's ever had a mama. Not necessarily the woman that gave birth to you, but a wise soul that pulled you aside one day and imparted some kind of information or knowledge that stuck with you for years. Could be a sister, a friend, an auntie, an oma, a nana. Well, aside from my own mama, mine was my great granny. Great granny would sit us young ones down by the riverside on Sundays, and she would hold women's camp. That's what she called it. Great granny say everybody always running around looking for a revolution. Most people wouldn't know a revolution if it snuck up and bit them on it. Great granny say the real revolution lies on the skins of women and their palms, and their scalps, their thighs and backsides. She said most people call them stretch marks. But they be history lines tracing back to our very first ancestors. Great Granny told us stories about strong women that led underground railroads with babies on their backs. Women that were hoes and pushed aside that stood in long lines demanding change. She told us stories about Nzingas and Ansadas, Winnies and Tuckers, Sojourners, Maybells and Estelles. Great Granny showed me her own lines once. For your eyes only, she said. And she lifted up her apron and dress and with two fingers starting from the insides of her palms, leading to the tops of her shoulders, down and around her tummy, running up her thighs and down her backsides. History lines. The next time you see a woman, just watch the way she walks and talks, moves and cuts through space. It's cause she ain't running around looking for no revolution. She already living and breathing it. They don't call her no revolution. They don't call her no revolution, child. Granny say, they don't. Call her no revolution, child. She just is. Minnesota Original is made possible by the Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund and the Citizens of Minnesota. Minnesota.